In this video, I'll be teaching you pistol stitch for hand embroidery. You'll want to have already learned the French knot for this stitch. And here's what pistol stitch might look like when you're done. Start by bringing your needle up through your fabric. Wrap your floss around your needle much like you'd wrap for a French knot. Bring your needle back down through your fabric any distance, making sure to hold the loose end of your floss just like you'd hold it if you were stitching a normal French knot. And that's pistol stitch. I'm going to add two more pistol stitches for decorative effect so you can see it demonstrated just a couple more times. This is a great stitch to use when stitching flowers or to add other decorative elements to your designs. And as you can see, it's basically a French knot with a long tail, so you can modify this stitch not just by modifying how many strands of floss and wraps you use, as is the case in modifying the French knot, but also by changing up how long or short you make your tail. And that's it. I hope this was useful.